well, we're just driving through the country here, northeast Thailand, and I looked to my left and I saw this massive. Good morning from a sunny Udon Thani on a Sunday morning. Okay, guys, uh, as you know, we just bought this land, okay, and uh, what we want to do is put these little like bamboo huts on uh, the land, you know, so we can chill out, do some cooking there, and uh, just chill out and enjoy the area where we bought the land. That's right, on here. So uh, we're looking at these little bamboo huts here. See, my wife sitting on there. So my wife's just phoning them up to find out how much uh, these cost. And you've got these uh, tables and chairs down here. Oh, that's pretty good. And what they've done, they've burnt the bamboo here to give it that sort of, uh, as I say, like a camouflage effect. So yeah, they look all right, yeah? And I love the straw in there. It looks really sort of like country. Typical Thai, look inside or bamboo because bamboo is pretty strong that'll last a long time you know yeah I like that you like that honey yeah. okay. see some horses down there found this one here this is slightly bigger than the ones over there I think I could actually stand up in this one but I like the light the little sort of decking at the front like you know that's uh, nice and that's pretty spacious inside look at that now this is quite new because the bamboo is still green but just look at that oh, I can sleep there you know but they say that dry one is last longer you have oh, to really? keep the uh, bamboo is dry first to view that one is last longer oh ok and it's green not good enough to dry ok yeah. there you go guys so if the dried out one it lasts longer if it's green well I suppose it can get some sort of uh, dampness and start rotting but there you go and there you go there's the grass roof it's very uh tropical tie yeah i like that one i wonder how much that is that's nice and you got the telephone number over there so yeah we definitely want to get some huts for our farm you know somewhere just to chill out cook and then we can sit there and eat Looks like you can actually sleep in this one. But yeah, sound. Huge big Buddha. Now it's somewhere around here. And I mean this Buddha is massive, okay guys? So we're just having a look as we're going. Oh, I've seen it. I've seen it. Now did we turn here? Yeah? Okay. In search of the big Buddha. Yeah, it must be a special day today. Okay, so we'll just turn here, police around everywhere. There's me holding a camera in my hand while I'm driving. Okay. To my left, in the background there, is the Big Buddha. That is huge. That's got to be the biggest one in Northeast Thailand. They're building from a line here, yeah, or no? That's right, yeah. They're still uh, building it. Okay, this is the entrance to the temple where the big Buddha is. That's right, yeah. So we haven't been here before. I think we actually turned just here, yeah? Yeah, turn here. Yeah, this guy's waving me this way. Okay. Yeah, it's a lot here. Okay, he's telling me to go down there. It's huge, eh? They have food Yeah? What I'm going to do, I'm just going to do a little turn around this way and go just here. Look at that Buddha, wow. Okay, let's park up alongside this car here. Well, we're just driving through the country here, northeast Thailand, and I looked to my left and I saw this massive Buddha. So we parked in the car park here. There seems to be something going on. There's a lot of people here also wearing yellow shirts because of the king. So uh, I'll just turn this around. I'll just show this massive, huge Buddha. There you go. Look at that. 
That is really impressive, I'll tell you. It's huge. I don't know if you can see it, but there's some guys up there working just near the neck of the Buddha. That is awesome. Okay guys, I just want to show you something here. Let's check that out. A nest right near our bedroom window with an egg in it. <laughs> amazing. Well yesterday I've done some tidying up in the garden. It's starting to look quite nice now. What do you think of that guys? I tell you what, cutting the grass when it's like 90 degrees, God, that gave me a bit of a headache. But as you can see around the stepping stones there, it was quite nice that. So the go. Let's see the security guard go past. So I just thought I'd show you guys our garden, what it's looking like at the moment. It's looking quite nice now. Because I'm standing on the balcony up here, there you go. Nice big balcony. Surrounded by palms everywhere here. This side. Now, yesterday, just underneath that Buddha there, there was a big snake. And I saw a little kitten looking there and I thought, what's happening there? Stood up, had a look. Yeah, it was playing with a snake, wasn't it? I couldn't tell what sort of snake it was, but by the time I got up and went out there and had a look, the snake gone and the wild cat where he went off. You got, you got coconuts in the tree there, can you see the coconuts? Wow, what a beautiful afternoon. There's another little nest down there. Just underneath there if you can see it. See the coconuts pretty clear this side and on the other side there as well. Another beautiful afternoon in paradise. I'll just show you around the garden. I just showed you from the top. Now I'll just show you down here now. Now I shaped up that little bush there. I'll call that the ball bush. It's quite nice now. A stone table and chairs. God, everything's growing so fast here, it's unbelievable. Yeah, I only cut this yesterday, eh? Look, it's already grown a couple of inches already. That grass is amazing. Beautiful day. Yeah, like I said before, okay, uh, just down there, okay, in that little hole there, a snake came out. It was pretty long. I mean, it's not big, it was just long and thin. And the cat was playing around with it here. Because when I came out, the cat looked at me and the snake just went off then. Gone on underneath the Buddha, I think. Wow, just look at that now. 
I'm quite happy with my garden actually, it looks quite nice. Especially when we put the umbrella up, just sit on there with a the beer. Just chill out. Okay guys, well I'd like to say thank you for watching this and uh, subscribe, share and like. I hope you like the huge Buddha, that was amazing. I absolutely love things like that. Yeah, so guys, as I said before, thank you so much for watching my videos. Uh, come back again and help me make another video. And you stay safe around the world, okay? In these hard times. I'll catch you guys later. Bye-bye.